Sulfide. As you can see, it's not very rubbery. Wouldn't keep out much water. And uh, it's just going to get in the way. There's also um, what appears to be putty on there. So before that can go back on the boat, it needs to come off. That looks like caulking. Someone tried to stop the leaks by just sticking some caulking underneath the edge. Not particularly effective. Now, believe it or not, this piece of teak was cut from a single block. And given that a six inch by three quarter inch by one foot is $36, a block that size costs an arm and leg. If you could get a block like that, I don't think you can get a block like that nowadays. So. Needless to say, I need to be very careful with this. There's four of them on this boat. Clean it up, fix it up, and get it ready to put back on. So we'll start with the long pieces, get those cleaned up, and uh, take it from there. it for another day another adventure on little bear i didn't get all the teeth taken care of all those little bits have yet to be done but it's kind of a, a tedious painstaking process clamping them down uh, they're using a wire wheel on my angle grinder to get all that gunk off which works really well but uh, it just takes time in the meantime i'm going to go home and enjoy the evening i think you should too so fair winds following seas and God bless. And remember, if you like these videos, hit the like button. If you don't like them, don't hit the like button. And if you really, really like them, hit subscribe. It helps. Thanks.